Let's connect it and see how uh, this system works. We see that the indicator uh, it is uh, uh, show that the system it is activated. Welcome to Kiga Engineer College. Today's session is a special because uh, we are going to see the something which is uh, uh, usual in the daily life and it is the uh, price race because it will facilitate you to install something in your car uh, or to install for, for the others who don't know to install it. So, uh, today's session is about the Aram system, which is a, a system which is uh, found in the anti safety system. It is the system used to uh, to prevent your vehicle uh, for thief or to warn you when your vehicle face uh, with the someone who have no authority uh, from you. So uh, we are going to see the fact of all the materials, uh, equipment and tools uh, you can use uh, while you are, you are going to install your arm system in the vehicle. Uh, so, the first equipment, uh, there is uh, here digital multimeter. Uh, it will help you to, uh, to measure the some continuity, the some voltage, uh, and also the current. So, there is the tool, uh, this is the fryer. Uh, it is the tool which can help you uh, to cut some wire uh, for draining uh, and other things. So the materials uh, you will use uh, there is the wire, wires, uh, insulator. Uh, here there is the arm remote uh, control. Uh, they are two. There is the bumps or ramps in this system to indicate you uh, some indicator light while you are vehicle one you uh, there is some uh, problem on your vehicle so there is a uh, horn so it is just to uh, to produce an acoustic sound to warn you that your vehicle it is in the danger so there is the rivet this is the, the, the used to, to receive the low control current uh, to control the high voltage. So this is our module. Uh, it is used to control this system. Uh, and also there is here the sensor. This is the sensor that detected uh, some person near your vehicle when there is no authority for you. When he touch on or she touch on the door, uh, the, just the alarm it is just to be activated to warn you where you are. Your vehicle uh, it is in the danger. So there is the wires and the connector. Uh, it is included in the wire harness and also uh, there is the some fuse. Uh, fuse it is it, it is it is just the protective device used in electrical vehicle to protect the, your circuit against a uh, burn. Uh, it it, it just act as the uh, uh, instead of the burn of the something which is expensive it, 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 it will be burned uh, in its press. So and also here there is the wire harness. This harness it is it, our central and rock door system and, and its actuators. So <coughs> As we see the component and also the last one but not least there is the battery. The battery you know it is used in the vehicle to produce the uh, primary electrical power or energy uh, to control or to activate the whole electrical system in the vehicle. 
So let's see how this uh, those components it is storage. Also, let's connect in its in its port. Let's start in the hey, and also there's something I forget. There is the indicator lamp that indicates your alarm system. It is updated. So let's connect it. If you have the two pin. After this indicator, we will connect the sensor. We have the three pin. We just connect to where we connect to pin. And also, let's connect this wire harness to its position. And also, it's well connected and connect with this central rocking system wire harness to its position this is uh, how it connected in the control module of alarm system so let's explain you those wires and where it will be be connected will be connected first of all this orange uh, wire it is from the uh, the brake brake switch uh, unit down the brake switch uh, this is the, it's from the uh, ignition ignition switch so and also this group uh, it's a ground for the dog switch and also those those ground wire with fuse uh, uh, they are adjusting the target on the uh, uh, direction indicator, light or ramp. So maybe the first one when we start on the left side, the uh, direction indicator, light or ramp, and this uh, on the left side, direction indicator ramps. And in this pink wire, you will start on the hole. And this is the power supply, drug supply, uh, voltage. And also, this is the, you will tap on the relay, the ground of the coil of the relay, which will be provided by this module. And also, this is the negative of the, this module, we connect to the negative negative one. So this is the wires for the central locking system. Uh, we will not consider about it because we are going to see how to connect with this and how to So as we we told you let's first start let's start first start on this
safety way and efficient way, you can use this manual uh, that come together with this kit of the alarm. So, so let's continue. The lamp is also already uh, connected. Let's uh, negative of the lamp for more variable. Let's put some extension here to make more flexible. Let me we show you where without something that you so. You see that we connected the negative one, so let's isolate it with the iterator to prevent some, some electrical short circuit. So, and also in the positive, we is red with the wire insulator or the insulator so and the negative let's isolate the negative here so Finish isolate. Let's isolate here. So we finish to isolate the and we start with the direction indicator ramp. So let's connect it the negative of the here and also connect the negative of the of the alarm this is the negative of the alarm we just connect to here also because both are the negative isolate the ramps and also we just going to connect the horn to the module because we see that this pink is for the positive of the horn so we just isolate it We finish to start the whole uh, indicators, direction indicators. So uh, we're going to see this wire. It's for for the negative of the relay. This yellow one. Just is red. So, for those steps very well, it will help you to install your alarm system in your vehicle or the vehicle of others. We see that this is the from the ignition switch. So, let's put on the side. It, those are the this is for the negative of the uh, it's for the negative of the brake switch so this is the, for the negative of the brake switch you just put aside uh, 
uh, we don't have switch here. So, and also those uh, uh, this rate have the four pin. It means that this is the uh, normal rate present uh, change of a switch. So, when you supply the current to the coil, it is just a break. But normally it is frozen. Let's connect the red one to the brown one because it is it, it, the ignition cut off wire. So, and we will see, I think the, uh, the usual thing is the, the, the storage. Right side is right here. And the red is connected. Start So you see this is the positive and this is the will be trigger on the ignition. Suppose that this to, to, to connect those it, it just to turn on the ignition uh, and we just to see the negative one. Just see the negative one. When you are going to connect, you first start from the positive. Positive one. And this is the sensor. See that the, lamp, the indicator lamp it shows that our system it is activated and the lock those are work on the central door uh, central door control so and also there is the cancel cancel the, the, uh, the acoustic sound there is again to, to activate the uh, this this home to uh, come back so there are two remotes when you use one, uh, you use the others. So, this is how the arm system it is installed in the vehicle. Uh, you can't go furthermore for how you install here on this table. Thank you so much.